morning everyone so what we have here today is the Kubota mini excavator and this is KX161 okay so this this mini excavator currently having some problem with the um, the power so we don't really know what is exactly the problem so we're gonna figure out the uh, problem and after that we'll fix the problem and to bring back this machine back to the normal um, power right so without any further ado let's get to work Okay, so the power of this excavator is dropping when I try to move uh, the function um, even the uh, track to move forward and then the power is immediately dropping so maybe the engine is overheated because I can hear that the engine sound is something like the compression is loose Okay, now you can see that the oil is coming out from this deep stick uh, hole right here. All the oil is um, flashing out from this engine, which means that this engine is currently having the uh, compression issues, issue. Okay, so there is one more thing that I see is not right on this machine as you can see here there is one tong and the tong is actually connected to the engine right over there and the original hose should be this one as I just run the engine I noticed that 
the water is actually not written back to the uh, red radiator but the water is actually going up to the tongue if the water is not written back to the radiator which means that the water is not cooling down the water should be uh, from this radiator here and the water will enter to the water pump and the water pump will pump the water to go inside of this engine and after that the water will return back to the radiator which is then the radiator will cool down the water and then after that the water will go back to the engine so that is the exact circle for the water system but now they already installed this tong right here and the water is not directly written to the uh, radiator instead of the water will go up and it's going up to the stone so i'm not really sure that this uh, this particular setup is it really work or else is it really uh, the cost the temperature for this engine is over the normal temperature okay so that is the problem for this machine they just told me that yeah forget about the engine first don't do anything on the engine they really want to use this um, machine urgently what we're gonna do now is to try to fix the hydraulic pressure so they actually requested to check the hydraulic pressure because before this even the engine is on on this condition the machine is working like uh, normal Okay, so this is the valve on the main pump. So basically the function of this valve is to open and close the direction of the hydraulic uh, pressure and also it change the direction of the hydraulic pressure right so as I check all the component inside of this valve there is no problem Okay, so this is the control valve and we are looking at the uh, main relief so the main relief for this excavator will be at the bottom over there so that's gonna be the main relief one piece of this control valve is one function and this one is for one function this one function yeah, every um, piece of this control valve is for one function. So this is the um, pressure from the pilot. So the main relief we will control 
all the pressure on this control valve the relief valve is controlling only one function of this um, excavator Okay, so this is all the component inside of this uh, pressure relief. So as I check all the component, there is no damage and is actually in a good condition. So I'm gonna install back this. There is no problem for the uh, pressure relief and also the valve. I don't really know what exactly the problem for this machine for the hydraulic system. All I can see is the problem is coming from the engine. The engine is not uh, powerful or it's not running normally. So now I will try to run this machine again. is still the same I can really confirm that the engine is the problem and if the engine is not enough power to give a mechanical power to the pump and the pump will not be strong enough to actually operate
just adjust the bucket when just now I try to open and close the bucket to the limit and the engine is not dropping okay so now we stop doing the adjustment for the pressure because I think there is no point for that even if we uh, adjust the pressure to lower down and yet the engine is still not um, enough power to supply to the main pump it will still the same we put back all the adjustment back to the original um, level and just now they told me that they want to repair the engine also on the part 2 of the video we will repair the engine I think that's all for today's video and see you guys on the next video